Hi all, and welcome to the video. In this one, it's Let's Build a Toon Series 5, number 12. Well, we're still here in Adonis. We've done the usual dailies. I didn't bother recording them. And we have managed to hit 140, which means I had enough IP to use this, which I think is a little better than that, at least for now. Uh, we did another one of the uh, Halloween ones, and I picked up some other bits of armor. I want to have a quick look through. There's these legs which don't have the same ACs as that. I'm going to stay with the ACs for now. These do. I think these are pretty good. I'm going to go with these. And what was this chest? 530, very melee based. And then there was this bit of armor. So I'm going to pop that on as well. That's a uh, ranged armor helmet, which gives assault rifle we don't really need. But you know, it's all ACs, and I think ACs are, will be coming in to their own. I think the only other thing I've updated was that. I just put in a slightly better waist implant. That's about it. Now, we're here. We made a bit of a start on the Adonis quest, and I've talked to the next guy um, who wants me to go off and kill some mobs, which I think we can probably do, but the Briar Kier, the custodian... I think he's going to wreck our trader. So, to get to these guys... Um, tricky. Yeah, there's a couple of different ways. One involves a lot of swimming. Uh, the other one, not so much. I think, actually, City South, believe it or not, may well be the one. Now, if we fail at this point... Oh, my God. Flicker much. If we fail at this point, then... I think it's time to go back to Sheol. Do a little bit there, maybe? Could be a thing. We shall have to see. So, yeah, I, I, I was going to record the Smuggler's Den, but the last two times I've been there, uh, people have been running in with their 220s in the same area to complete uh, various missions, which is, you know, that's fine, that's cool, I get it. You know, people do that kind of thing. Um, it is expedient, let's say. However... Uh, a couple of them wear pet classes, and if you don't know, if you go blitzing through there on a pet class with pets in tow, oh my god, do the mobs go a bit crazy. Yes, they do. Like, in a major way. that You know, the mobs were basically everywhere. Uh, we, we really struggled in there, you know, we were quite happily in a little quiet space, getting on with whatever we were doing, but no... <laughs> you're going to die as you know half a dozen or more or even a couple of dozen mobs come running in and start kicking your backside i couldn't calm them all i had to use a uh, good old pyramid marketing and do a runner so it was a bit of a tricky one today but hey not too bad I had to keep running out snaring all the guys that were out there and there was it was like every veteran and what have you mob in there was coming out and doing things to us uh, i think i died twice in total so we had a bit of a uh, bit of a loss in uh, a, a h uh, xp etc so there's a little bit of that going on uh, but yeah we're gonna be okay i think now if i remember rightly there's only one tricky jump to make here if we don't make it, we're going all the way back to Arubakar, which won't be good. I think we should be okay, though. I've got Faster Than Your Shadow, which always helps. That one there adds 250 to run speed. It's usually pretty good. Okay, we're kind of on the wrong side of this, actually. But it's not the end of the world. I mean, push comes to shove, we'll just swim, which I don't want to do. I want to be on the other side of this path, though. See, this is what happens. Busy yabbering away, 
thinking of things to say for the video and start getting it wrong in game. It's harder than you may think, actually. When people criticize, I always feel like, okay, I, I look forward to watching your video where you commentate most of the way through it. And they never do. All the atmospherics in here are very atmospheric. Yeah, there's quite a few stages in here I really don't think we'll be able to do. Um, the tougher mobs, etc. We would either need a complete team and or um, a bit of a ringer. That is, you know, someone's 220 to come in and uh, take care of things for us. I did the key quest while I was here. I've, I've, I think I've got about four videos with it in. Uh, it's not a tricky quest, to be honest. It's fairly easy, to be honest. I mean, it, it it's a bit of running, and it does feel like it takes a long time, but, you know, you kill one mob and then click on a couple of things, and that's kind of about it. I'm not even sure this is quicker, you know. I think maybe the swimming would have been <laughs> a little bit faster. I don't know. And, of course, there is a, an item I want from Adonis. I will probably try and tackle in about 10 levels time, which is the Dark Ruins. I do want to try that out, that, that appeals to me. Get a thousand ACs and some nano skills into the bargain. That sounds pretty nice to me, I have to say. Right, we're coming up to the waterfall jump. Nope, not yet. It's pretty close to here. I think this is it here. If we don't make it, I'll see you at the uh, the area we're going to because I'll have to run all the way back. Yeah, yeah, we made it. Wasn't sure, thought we would probably do it, and that is with oh, how much run speed have I got? Only like eleven hundred and something. So, and that is with faster than your shadow. But one k is better than less than one k run speed in this sort of area. That oh. Th that is always kind of painful, I have to say. Okay, we're coming up on where we want to go. I need to be careful here because the Amok Barton is here. That's uh, another stage in the quest line I don't think we can uh, manage solo for sure. He's usually down in this valley here. Let's just zoom in. We'll get a mark for him. Yeah, right about here. There he is. Ooh. Let's not. For a 220, he's absolutely a piece of uh, easy work. There you go. He's a piece of easy work. Yes, he is. Now, these guys will most likely hand our backside to us, but, you know, we'll see. We need to be a good distance away. Kiting, I don't think, is going to work. Routing, maybe. Okay. Not the guys we need. Pulling them, we're just going to have to hope that using the device works. I'm not actually seeing any. Okay, that's one we need. We need to be a fair distance away but still in line of sight. Can I even know I can't see him? Can I use this? Okay, let's not be around for the other mobs to see what's going on. Okay. I've got a drain up. Also, not a good thing. Get these on him. Okay, nice. AC buff. Perks. Ooh, we're going to have to do some healing. Um, why not? Three. Come on. Hit it. Why is this not fire? Am I debuffed? I think I'm debuffed. I don't think I got all my... Uh, They're on him now. Okay, let's try him with the AOE. No. Nope. Yeah, the buffs didn't land on him. 
No. Let's try that again. Yeah, they did. Okay. That'll be why we couldn't heal. <laughs> oh, dear me. Not a best start. Okay, nice. However, we're going to start to get a lot in the way of faction. Okay, now I've drained up. Maybe I should have drained up before coming here. That's probably what I should have done. Not reacting. There we go. And let's keep out of sight of the other mobs. Don't hit him until... Yeah. Okay, nice. Okay, this is actually working a lot better than I thought it would. What level is this guy? It's 159, so he's no joke. Not in Shadowlands. And also, obviously, a spider mob. Let's keep these running on him. He's actually feels like he's got less HP and easier to kill than some of the smuggler mobs. Which is a little odd. Okay, let's try you. Yep, he's coming. Saw him move, saw him move. We don't want to be anywhere near the other guys when he gets here. No, we don't. And drain him. Okay, this is working. I don't think it's going to work as well on the last guy for this section, though. Okay, I think he is he nuking. I can hear nukes landing, and I don't have any. Love that heal. Yes, I do. Nice. Yeah, it's definitely chewing up faction now. Okay, let's try you. Okay, we're getting a bit of a rhythm here. Getting, getting into it here. Getting... Uh, Cocky. That's what you're doing. You're getting cocky. Don't get cocky. Now, I have got a new perk, but you won't see me using it while I'm soloing. It's this. Sacrifice. I lose, like, 1,000 to add all off. He and the team gain however much they gain. Not good for soloing, unfortunately. One more. Okay. We're getting close to the point now, I think. Let's check faction. Yeah, it's still on indifferent, but that won't last. Eventually these will aggro on sight. So I'd rather keep quite a bit of distance. Okay, can I? Okay. Let's not be too close to that guy. I think we're okay here. Yeah, I'm liking this. This is a bit more like it. One at a time, it, the, the situation is quite easy to control, otherwise not so much. can hit for 1k though. Don't get cocky. Do not get cocky. That's when it all goes wrong. Yes it is and you know it. Okay and then 
it's these guys. I don't know if they're harder or easier to be honest. Why do they always say, check out my tail? That will it kind of sounds like that, look at my tail, something my tail. If anyone knows what they actually say, comment below. I'm not sure. Debuff. Keep our nano as high as we can. Okay. Not too shabby. And we've got a veritable basket of them here. Ooh, yeah, these guys... He's still hitting pretty hard. Has everything landed on him? I think pretty much it has. And, uh, yes, we're on full death. Are you kidding? This is Shadowlands, my friend. Everything hits like a train. Three more. Three more, and then he's going to send me to something I probably won't be able to do. Because the boss guy you have to fight, not so easy. These guys are a little higher level, I think. Yeah, 166. So they're a little bit harder. Doable, but harder. Again, no battle music again. There you go. So weird. Why does it do that? I don't know. Are any of these guys a little lower? Ooh. He is definitely not. Let's not pull that one. Let's try and find one that's not quite so high level. Are they all going to be red now? Ooh, they're all red. Okay, so what level is this guy? 169. He's about the lowest I can see. So he's going to do. The other guys were like a little bit less. So, you know, not quite so scary. Yeah, debuffs have landed. Let's make sure we get the bleed on him. Definitely. Definitely wanting that. Don't, don't, don't. And again, no battle music. What's going on with that? Let's do, let's do this. It's a really weird bugger. No idea why that happens. You are 170, okay. I'm not happy about it either, dude. No, I'm not. I just don't want your friends coming. Okay, rinsing and repeating, hopefully. The other option is not a good one. Yeah, I don't really dare go much above full death. And we've got to the stage now where we can pretty much get into this item, which I was given a little while ago. But would it help? I don't think it would at this stage. Oh, this guy's not... Really not doing much, is he? The debuffs did more to sort of... Ooh. Right, okay. So now, 
we get an actual mission. Destroy the custodian. This will be the part where we die. Right, let's uh, teleport back. I'm not sure running around this side was the quick way, you know. I think swimming... Swimming might have been the way to go. Let's save the XP we've got. Character saved. Okay. Because you know damn well. If I think we're going to die, we probably will. City South again. Should we look for a dojo while we're here? Maybe, let's... Oh, that's not good. Okay, they're only sunfish, they're only sunfish. And they've debuffed me. Oh, that's not good. Uh, how about now? And the route didn't land either. Run away! Yes, run away. One at a time. Mobs not a problem. Multiple mobs on Trader. Not nearly as much fun. No, they're not. That's where things start to get a little too complicated. I could have probably battled through that, I think, but... I kind of chickened out. Okay, let's close that. Let's have as much map as we can get. Cascading spirit. Do you drop anything useful? Ooh. Other than lots of your friends onto us. No, thank you very big. Okay, is the mission further over? It is further over. Always trips me up. I see this area here and think, ah, oh, yes, here we are. N no, it's that one. And yeah, I'll have to come back and kill these guys later, but there do seem to be quite a few of them. And like I say, what's our nano resist? Not brilliant. That is something we are going to have to plunge. I mean, look how much actual IP is in there. Like, nearly none. Going to have to max that. And I've got ten levels where, where I can't really put much into other skills. They're all level capped until we get to 150 but the nice thing is you get to 150 and of course you can spend more IP not a lot more but a little more I don't think we're going to handle this guy being completely honest I think it's going to get very messy I think the ads aren't going to be too big a problem ok he's not attacking that's good our faction isn't that terrible. Right. Usually you find quite a few mobs inside here as well. That will attack. What have I got? Yeah. Okay, let's drain up before we get anywhere near the boss room. Oh, really? That's better. There we go. Anything? No. Uh, I think it's straight ahead. Usually. Dirty money, shadow crystal, disciplinary action. Yeah, take that. That's possibly rare. Not too sure. Okay, these guys we're going to have to deal with. No line of sight from there. Yeah. That's, that's weird. I bought 50 recharges. If I put those in a bag, that's something else. Time to sort bags out. I have too many of them. Hmm. Not that we're going to get much chance to use those in here. Okay. What level is the guy, is he? 
He's not too bad. He's not too bad. But I can't remember what debuffs he's got. That's the thing. If he ran, you know, if he debuffs all our nano skills or cancels all our buffs, oh my god, we're not going to be fighting him in a hurry. No. Okay, let's save this one. Is it just him? It looks like it's only him up there. Okay, folks. Here goes nothing. Oh, landed, landed. Okay, let's debuff the rest. And use that on him. And that humidity. Okay, he hits like a train. And I've just used the wrong thing. Come on. Okay, can I root this guy? No. Okay, he's hitting like hell. That's like 1k he's hitting for there. The only thing I've got going is like hack and quack. And a bit of a drain. Started off very well. Is he still coming? He is still coming. Can I not... I really need to take his offense and, and what's it do? Oh, too slow. I didn't even see the damage. Oh, he nuked me. Okay. Fair enough. And we lost a little bit of XP, but that was just from killing the mobs inside there. Ah, oh, goddamn. Okay, well, that didn't work out so well, did it? No, no, it didn't. So, yeah. It was a nuke that actually got me, I think. Go back to Rubicar for all the buffs. Nanobots for 1600, yeah. That's what did it. I mean, he was hitting fairly hard anyway. When you start getting, you know, nuked like that. It's definitely time to start considering how much IP you have put into your nano resist. And we're back. Now, you probably noticed this is not Adonis. No, it isn't. And it's not Sheol either. No, it isn't. We're pretty close to actually leveling. So, the thing I thought would be nice probably try and grab a hecklet but the cluster is a bit uh, close by now these guys are all 161 so still viable xp i just thought these might be a little good idea plus a little more Guardian faction while we're about it and I can probably fight them off full death. You know, all the way up to there. It would seem so. Although it's probably not the best idea in the world, but there we go. Oh I've got XP to recruit uh, recruit? Recoup. Okay, there's one there as well. I don't think there's anything anywhere near it, so... Oh, yeah. If we can get to 141, then we can head back into Sheol and go and talk to technologist Frank Jobin. I've got the thing he needs. I kind of preemptively thought I probably would need it, as you may have guessed. God, it's so murky around here. And that's what catches you out, you see. Is he coming? Did I not get him? I think I did. Yep, he's coming. He's getting a little further away from the others. That should do it. Ooh, bit of lag. And one more of these guys will do it, I think. Let's just be careful on how we pull one. Okay, I choose you. 
Am I just getting one or am I running all the way to Sheol? I think I'm only bringing one with me. I think the others are out of harm's way. Yeah, now we're talking. So I've still got the Yottos and Scientists quest in Sheol, but I can't remember what the... You get a nano at the end of each one, but I cannot remember which. There we go, one for one. And if you say it, do it. Ooh, ow. Still, we need it. Right, running to Sheol. God, it gets brighter when you come away from the edge, doesn't it? Oh yeah, it definitely does. Uh, we have still, I hope, yeah, I've got a bag of insignias, so it's not the end of the world. Ten more levels. Sounds like a plan. And the thing of it is, we're going to need 19 more levels to get to Penumbra. And then item rewards and such do start to become more appealing. Yes, they do. Yeah. We changed over to British winter time officially at uh, 2 o'clock this morning. So it is now officially the time you see on my screen. Although to me it feels at least an hour later. And it, it generally does for a few weeks, unfortunately. Okay, now we had the scouting panorama. Is it even worth talking to him? Because you can't finish the Yotto's quest until you've done the scientists one so that's a thing now jobin can i upload that has that actually got a oh it does there you go yeah he's there and the nearest as you can see that mirador or however you pronounce it garden no i don't have the shiol key Oh, insight into Shadowlands terminated. Okay, Mirador. This one. Unfortunately, we do have to run past a lot of scary mobs. Now, we talk to him. Go kill a couple of things at Incarnators. We're not going to get the rest of the Adonis quest done without help, I don't think. And people are at lunch in Storm, so... It's difficult because I don't like to record in the evenings because children are in bed and such. So, even though I have acoustic treatment in this room, I do not have soundproofing. They're two different things. A lot of people think they are the same thing. They are not. Unfortunately, I wish they were. Oh, really? You're going to walk me back? Stop that now. Boom. There we go. There's our guy. Technologist Frank Jobin. Uh, what you, can you tell me about this structure? Structure? Yeah. That bloody great structure there. Really? Really? You followed me all the way down. Can you be calm? No? How about... Drained and killed. I'm thinking drained and killed. Sorry about that, Frank. Tell me about the incarnators. I'm just kind of keeping an eye out for any more, you know? Okay, goodbye. Crystal filled by the source. I don't even think it matters what quality. Hope not, because I've only got a quality... What is it? 50. There you go. XP for the win. Look, that's quite a lot of XP. I'm ready. And okay. So, the mission says... Oh yeah, he's still talking. There you go. Mission says... Notum Crystal, Immature Voidling at the Incarnator. Immature Voidling, and that one is back up, actually. 
which is no biggie. I'm not saved here. I don't plan on saving here. I probably should if I was going to continue the rest of this quest here. But rather than try and do the entire quest in one episode, I, th I think that's tiring to watch. It's extremely tiring to do. I don't mind sitting back on a Sunday afternoon and chilling out with a nice big mug of tea and some toast and getting through that quest but yeah it is definitely it's a little bit much i'd say it's um it's just so damn long-winded that's the problem more than anything else all the running i mean i think on my big fixer i didn't do this quest until he was 220 and he was just farming research and then it wasn't so bad you see because number one he was a fixer he was very very fast and number two he was a fixer and he was very very fast <laughs> and also at 220 nothing in in the quest is more than annoying when it runs away nothing is a threat so the, you know there's that kind of a thing some people do do it that way, but I would quite like the nanos from this quest. I can't remember what they were. I remember looking at them, or looking up what they were, and thinking, oh, yeah, I should uh, I should definitely get that. But yeah, there is so much running. Even if you save and you use, you know, insurance beacon and yada, yada, yada. Yeah, it's still... Uh, Still pretty tough going. That's where we want to go, to that incarnator over there. And look, there's a moon underneath Sheol. Is it Sheol or Sheol? I'm never sure what Sheol is. It's one of the most dramatic looking areas, you know, it's very lush in places and then Surprisingly broken in others. There's an awful lot of stuff going around, etc. That's a lot of mobs. Are they all great? No, they're bloody not. God damn. Okay. That was a lot in one cluster. That full death. Can we lose them on the incarnator? Kind of hope so. It's going to go very badly if we can't. Usually you can lose mobs by coming on to an incarnator. Okay, let's just wait before we start, just in case. Is one coming? I think one may be coming. You really, really are taking the mix. Still, I use you for a drain pet, I think. Yeah, I, th I think that's the plan. Not that we really need it for the mobs we're about to spawn. Yeah, there we go. Are these the same as the things? What level is this thing? 106. Still green. Wow. Yeah, take it. Put it with all the others. There we go. Right, okay, so... It's the immature. Or is it that and click? There we go. I think, oh, you know what, full egg, screw it. Screw it, full egg. It's green. You can't handle this, you're not very good. There we go. I don't think it actually drops anything now. And we now want to get right the way across the other side of the map, of course. This is a Shadowlands quest. Of course you need to go bloody everywhere. No, I'm not going to get into it again. I'm not going to do Mr. Grumpy running a quest. No, I'm not. You know I am, don't you? You kind of... Yes, you are, Carlos. We know. We know you will. Don't lie to us kind of true now i did see as we were there that there was a granite spider and it was green which kind of makes me think 
let's not run through all the granite spiders on the way to this one. That might be a bad idea. Just saying, you never know. Yeah, these are going to give chase. And apparently our calm is useless. Now, it's always the way you... you the resistance on the mobs in Shadowlands. Well, if you get a Shadowlands calm and use it on Rubicar, it's super powerful. Let's try and get onto there. I think we will. I don't know if the mobs following can do it as well. I'm kind of trying to make it difficult for them. Why is it playing the You Died music and Resurrection? That's very unnerving. That's the Resurrection music you get. Okay. Ooh. Hello. It wasn't that long a run. I mean, our divest was still running, so. Yeah, I am giving some serious thought to trying this gun out and being on full death. You see there that I don't think it's as good, you know. I don't think it's as good as using these two. I could give it a try, I suppose, but the, the, the shatter gun? A lot of damage on that. I need to move that away from my... This is your HP bar, don't I really? Yes, I know I've got it there as well. I'm just more familiar with it. Really? 1k hits? Is our AC that bad? Isn't it? Must be. Oh, chunk of research. That's it. Even the small stages in this actually help. What did we get there? Fling shot. Get a bit more to shotgun. What did it require? That shotty. Let's have a look. We need 1300. We have... Well, we're nearly there then, aren't we? Self. It's a bit worrying, because self would imply it's not nearly high enough. You're a trader, you should be wearing very high quality gear. The thing is, at 151, we can pick up the special edition modified shotgun from, is it Sector 7 or Sector 10? I can never bloody remember. The Lobie Alien playfield that you can't enter after 200. Um, and that one definitely looks pretty good. I'll look it up while we're running. Okay, there it is. Special edition Kreisoch uh, shotgun. So you can see that absolute joke to get on. Fling shot from 350, shotgun from 700. Look at the damage on that. And it's 1-1. One, 1-1. One. One, one. That's nuts. Um, and look how we... I mean, that, I mean, you could get that on a level 60. That's probably why they put the level lock. But I think they set the level lock too high. They really do. Especially for something like a trader. I mean, come on. You know, once you get Nanite plunder and divest, and then a 131 of someone else, I mean, it ain't like you really need it anymore, is it? Where am I going? This way. When we talk to him, we may get another level. That's pretty much the only other reason I want to come here is try and get some more levels 151 particularly but that's just nuts that you can you can have that see there what's the damage so on dps 88.6 to 128 and then if you look at this one which is 195 don't forget 133 to 335 I mean, look at that, that's nuts. That's nuts that a 151 weapon is that much better. Will you bloody come? Oh, well, that's something. How long before these grey out, I wonder? 
sooner rather than later. See, that's what we like. We like when things calm. Okay, let's talk to our guy. Uh, I found them all right. Uh, when you said though, they are not friendly. And ding, nice. Find Doctor Hestia. Which one's she? Oh, she's back over there. Yeah, we we probably should have saved here, shouldn't we? Yeah, that that's what I'm thinking. What's the quickest way there? We can run back, or here's the other thing. Uh, oh, we can't, can we? No. I've got garden keys. We're actually quicker going to lower Sheol using the garden key there. I think it's slightly nearer. Not much, I grant you, but it is a bit. And our bit counts in Sheol. It is an interesting area though, that's the thing. I mean, the, the very lower part of Sheol is really quite interesting. However, you only ever have reason to go there once, I think, unless you're farming stuff from various mobs down there, I guess. There's, there's a bunch of named kind of hecklers and stuff down there. And you wander down on either the Yotto quest or this one. I can't even remember which. I think it's the Yotto one, to be honest. I think it is. And the Yotto one has the better nano crystal reward. Oh, you can still use those from a bag. Uh, you know what, save. I've got the garden key for Adonis. I can always get it back there really easy just by running to Wailing waste, Wastes and using the teleport there. The Highlands, actually. I think she's nearest that way. I think she probably is. Run speed, where are we at? What can we get to? God, it just does not go far, does it? Oh, no, it's not. Worth it. I'll wait till I've got nothing else I can spend in. Psychic is maxed. It's maxed. That's more useful, I think. Get the nano resist. Oh, okay, bit of a stutter there. It's an SLI thing, that though. The game is not designed to be run in SLI, really. I've just got it working. It means that um, the two graphics cards are, are just kind of sat there yawning. They feel like they're having a tea break. <laughs> My god, the sun is out in Sheol. It must be the first time I've ever been here and that's been the case. I can tell you that for nothing. Uh, we may even get to Dr. Hestia unfettered. Although, no, the Medusas will probably be green. Yeah, they're green. Oh, God, here we go. Still a bit unnerved by it playing the resurrection music. Hello, Hestia. What do you want? I can't remember. I don't care. Uh, oh, ancient. Have I got an ancient device? Is that it? Ancient device. There you go. Have an ancient device. Uh, there we go. That would be nice. Lift music time. Ooh, 200,000 credits. Bye. What, what have we got now? Uh, digging for trade. Bring back three different... Oh, yeah, yeah. Need to find urns. There's two and a mob. Knew you, dog. I knew you would aggro. Here we go. How about if I debuff you? How about, how about now? E could have just gone for that straight away. Um clicky oh do I use that or do I use this thing? It's that one. Okay, I need to put that somewhere. And I need to make more space. These are bags as well. 
Uh, bear with me one moment. Okay, we should have enough room now, so... Okay, that's two straight away, that's pretty good. Need three different ones, I think they're unique as well, so it won't let you... Yeah, no drop and unique. So you can't do much else. There you go. Okay, there's three here. Is that one? Yeah. Oh, there we go. Three nano programs you cannot use. Going back to Dr. Hestia. Yes, they are. There's a difference between challenge and annoyance. Green mobs and grey mobs, especially aggroing, are without doubt annoyance. Ooh, nearly a level. And when you're trying to get through the mantis den and there's grey stuff all around your legs. Yeah. Okay, and find Dr. Curry. Which one was Dr. Curry? Dunno. Let's use the garden key. Oh yeah, the one in lower shield. Yeah, it's a lot quicker with that. One of the most useful items in the veteran shop. Ah, oh, there we go. Here's curry. Linguistic anthropologist. Really? I'm here to learn more about the Zan. Honest. Not. I'm here for the XP. Plain and simple. Let, let, let's not even lie about it. We want the XP and we want the nano at the end of the quest. That's why we're here. Okay. Probably something I could have farmed earlier on. Word search. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We could have done that. Saved a bit of time. However, got three minutes on that, but I've also got a bag full of insignias sat there doing nothing. Except waiting to be used. So, yeah. Yeah, the first few stages are very, very quick. Yeah, I was down there killing them and I thought, well, the first couple of quests from the Yuttos involves killing the mobs I'm killing. Why don't I just grab the quest as well? So I did. Then did the one with the Bietz or Bets or however the hell you pronounce those impossible looking mobs. You know the ones that got like stilts for legs? It's the best way I can put it. These are the guys we want. Yeah, I think it's these. Ooh, we got a bit of resist then. Ooh, he's got a lot of resist. There we go, eventually. Okay, do some of this, some of this. And... Now we're talking. A bit of that. And that. But you calm. I may not even need you. Nah, you're not going to calm. No, if you guys have got that kind of nano resist, that ain't going to happen, is it? Let's face it. Excuse me while I just check your friend's remains. Nope. Okay. You're next, Lucky. Oh, this is so slow. Come off the full there. Apparently. No. Alright, one of the things didn't land. That's it. That's what we want. Okay. There we go. I wonder, I thought that was weird, like plunder's not landed, for whatever reason. Kind of weird. No. I'm sure it's these guys it drops from. Oh nice, and a ding. 143. Uh, I see, you've already got it. It's the book thing I want. It's the book. Has any of you got the book? The unredeemed are not liking me doing this now. You know it. 
I've got a ne. Oh. Are you a knight who says ne? I am a knight who says ne. Oh. No, nothing. Uh, we're going to be here for all bloody day. I know it. You know it. We all know it. But never mind. I'm going to leave it there. And I'm just going to say... Bye for now.